man with good fortune obtains him. Rare is the person who understands the Lord through Guru's guidance. Nanak says, if man slays his ego from within, then does he meet the Lord. Gujri third Guru, the man whose ego the Lord removes is at peace and is blessed with an ever stable intellect. Immaculate is the person who by Guru's guidance understands God and fixes his mind with his feet. O oh, my unmindful mind, remember thou the Lord and thou shalt obtain the fruit that thou desirest. By Guru's grace, thou shalt obtain Guru's elixir by continually drinking which thou shalt have eternal peace. When man meets the true Guru, then he becomes philosopher's stone. When he becomes such, the Lord then makes mortal worship him. He who adores him attains the reward and instructing others, he reveals to them the truth. Without becoming the philosopher's stone, man is not worthy of worship. He who without instructing his own mind instructs other, that ignorant blind man calls himself the Guru, but whom can he show the say? Nanak says, without his grace, nothing can be obtained and he on whom he looks the, with grace finds him. By Guru's grace, God grants him exaltation and makes his word pervasive in him. Gujri third Guru, Panchpade, enlightenment neither arises at Banaras nor it is lost there. By meeting the true Guru, wisdom